Hello everyone, so it is the morning. I'm going to see my grandma tonight. I'm really excited um, for all the girly sleepover stuff we're gonna do. But before that, I have to have my meeting with the modeling agency, get ready for it, and also finish my designs. So this is what we look like before. We got a pimple this morning, very nice, of course. My dad though made me a um, Dad Award, Dad of the Year Award goes to my dad. Um, but yeah, I will show you guys what I look like with better hair and makeup for this meeting. So we have completed hair and makeup. Very natural. I just did lip liner, a little bit of concealer and blush, and then nothing on my eyes. I still have my lift and tint. And then I'm wearing a black bodysuit. I just have my dad's hoodie on right now because I'm cold. And yeah, that's about that's about it. Um, I did a couple little curls in my hair, but figured natural is best. So I will let you guys know how it goes. Yeah, so the interview went really well. They did say it was a yes from them. And this is more commercial and acting. So I would do acting training, which I think is really cool because I've always wanted to try acting. And I can still get approached by other agencies for like more fashion modeling. So it seems neat. I have another interview with them on Friday just so that I can ask questions and you know do all my due diligence. But yeah, they seem really great and the guy was really nice to me. And um, based on some of the stories I've heard with my friends applying and whatnot, it was very positive because you know, some modeling agencies can be very strict and just, you know, not really positive but this guy was great he was really nice so uh, i'm going to think on it and do some more research into their work this would like i said be a lot of commercial work and acting which would be pretty cool so yeah now i'm going to work on my designs and then head over to my grandma's so i went to my grandma's house and look how cozy it is with the christmas tree oh my goodness i just love it so much she tried to do a little english dinner for me it was so adorable so we had uh, maple beans with mashed potatoes and broccoli this broccoli was so good it was lemon with garlic and sea salt oh it was delicious and then she's been really into this christmas dessert it's called christmas crackle and basically you lay down all these saltine crackers and then you make caramel which i don't know you just make caramel by mixing like vegan butter and brown sugar i mean the more you know really so you make caramel and then you spread it all over the crackers to kind of act as like a glue also look at the difference in the color between vegan caramel and regular caramel i thought that was interesting and then after you lay all your toppings on it so i did in that top corner just caramel and sea salt and at the bottom i did hazelnut sea salt and chocolate and then the top right is chocolate and cranberry juice good and then i did her makeup just some girl time grandma didn't want to be on camera of course so it was just for us and then we did face masks as well i did that poor cleansing one thank you grandma for the face mask pampering and after that it was time to pull the crackle out of the fridge you have to let it uh, cool for a little bit till it's hard and then you basically break it up into little pieces and oh my goodness this was such a sugar rush it was so sugary but it was absolutely delicious i loved it so much i would definitely recommend that you try out this recipe for the holidays so we just finished having our christmas tree which was so yummy as you guys saw and i did my grandma's makeup she loved the look i gave her and now we're gonna do face masks i also of course gave her the beautiful necklace from a happiness boutique and she loved it she actually teared up so i didn't she wants she doesn't want to be on camera and i obviously wanted to keep that moment between us but she absolutely loved it um this part of her christmas gift so i'm so happy she loved it and it's such a beautiful idea to get the birth flower for someone on a piece of jewelry for someone that passed and they can literally keep it close to their heart at all times i think it's such a sweet 
um, and thoughtful gifts. So be sure to check out Hey Happiness. They also have a bunch of gifting right now, which I will let you guys know about. So at this holiday season, Hey Happiness is spoiling everyone. So for orders over 39 euros, you get one surprise gift. For orders over 79 euros, you get two surprise gifts. And for orders over 109 euros, you get three surprise gifts. I love Hey Happiness so much. I ended up getting um, my dad's girlfriend a couple pieces from here and her daughter some earrings as well and then of course the necklace for my grandma it has the flower of my late uncle who passed away a couple years ago and she always goes to this bench and now she can wear this necklace close to her heart and think of him so i thought it was such a thoughtful gift um be sure to check out hey happiness i'll have their links in the description box so yeah, with all of that said, we are now going to do some nice face masks. I'm really excited. Um, we just picked up these ones from Shoppers. Um, my grandma picked out a couple like sleep masks and then I picked out this pore cleansing white tea one. Grandma's treat, thank you very much grandma for the face mask. So we're gonna do that and then we'll probably just keep watching. Right now we're just watching Selling Sunset because it's already 9 p.m. and that is past our bedtimes. <laughs> nowadays so we're gonna do masks and then head to sleep i also need to have a quick shower but yeah that's the the girls night routine it is oh, just the best i love a good girls night this is probably the most terrifying face mask i've ever <laughs> put on but maybe it'll help with this giant pimple i have on my chin fingers crossed good morning everyone so it is the morning after the girls night i had a good sleep in we had porridge for breakfast and we're meeting my dad in about two hours to go have Mexican. So I'm very excited for that. I haven't been to this restaurant in a long time. It's so good. And I'll show you guys what I get there. And then I'll probably just end the vlog after that. But it's just been so nice being at like the home where I grew up and with my grandma. It's just so cozy and comforting. I love it. And yeah um i think that's about all oh actually tonight we're going to do these like festive lights garden like christmas lights but it's like a walk through garden so actually i will film that and include that at the end of the vlog because that should be cool so i'll let you know and also we're supposed to get poke after so i'll also show you guys that so there will be some extra clips as well i mean you can't pass up filming food my camera definitely eats first unlike millie bobby brown I do fall victim to letting my camera eat first. <laughs> but yeah, I will keep you guys posted and I hope you just enjoy these relaxing chill clips. This is the type of videos I love having on in the background while like, I do my makeup and stuff. Just makes me feel a little bit like less alone. <laughs> just feels like we're on FaceTime. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys soon.